I will now explain the details of this mission. Team 7 will head to Mount Korgu. You have two objectives. The first is to rescue and join Shikamaru, Lee, and Neji. The other is to prevent Kuroma from continuing his destructive actions. According to the information we have gathered, Kuroma has amassed extraordinary power. I give you leave to take what steps you feel are necessary to deal with him. The second objective is also a request from Akari Tatsushiro. Hey! Naruto, save your questions for the end. It's alright. What is it, Naruto? Why is Akari's brother trying to do this in the first place? My brother said that it was revenge. Revenge? Revenge for what? Revenge against the world. My brother blames the world for what happened to him. The whole world, huh? That's a little over the top. Still, that giant Earth Genryo, along with all those Mugon, hey. If what appeared here in the village is just the tip of the iceberg, his claim of wanting revenge against the world might not be an exaggeration. But to go to such lengths for revenge, what do people do to your brother? That's... It may be related to this mission. We'd like to hear about it. Well... By the time we were old enough to understand, we were already drifting. We are the last descendants of a clan that was nearly wiped out and exiled. Because of our disfigurements, we were loathed no matter where we went. Some hated us because we were exiled. At first, my brother hated the lives we had to lead. He later directed his anger at the great nations that destroyed our clan. Great nations? She means the land of fire and the other neighboring countries. This was probably before the Great Ninja Wars, before the current nations were formed. Sins of the father and all that. My brother Kuruma sees us as innocents. The ones at fault are those who created a world where only they can survive. And that's why he wants revenge? Yes. Of course, he understood that doing such a thing isn't possible. But he discovered the Dragon Blade, and learned the dragons really existed. Once he learned that, he changed. Revenge and power change people. I have read as much. Kurama plans to use the Gendio's power to become a light dragon. Taking the powers of a Genryu? But that's like... Captain Yamato! Sorry. That's okay. It's true that he becomes something like a Jinturuki. Naruto. Please, stop my brother. Even if you must. It may be necessary to sacrifice your brother. Are you prepared for that? He doesn't listen to reason anymore. I understand that I'm being selfish. I can't give you much in the way of payment either. But there's no other choice. Someone must stop my brother. And that is why you came to us in the Leaf Village. Even if we do defeat him, it won't change anything. Akari, are you really fine with losing your brother?
But he has to be stopped from destroying the world. There's no other way. That's not true. Huh? I'm sure that your brother is alone. And just lonely, too. <gasps> I used to be all alone, too. No one would talk to me. And the way they looked at me only hurt me more. The pain of being alone. But then I thought, why am I the only one suffering like this? Then, I started glaring right back at everyone else. Naruto. <laughs> I can't really explain it that well. But I think your brother's just like how I used to be. He's angry at everyone else right now. So, I'm sure he'll come to understand too. Will my brother even listen now? Your brother is important to you, right? He's all I have. He is precious to me. Then we gotta save him for sure. Yes! Huh. I didn't expect the topic to shift to saving someone we're supposed to kill. Lady Tsunade, please tell us more about the mission. Akari will be accompanying you as your guide. She requested this herself. I'll also give you versions of the special equipment for those you'll be meeting. While inside Mount Koryu, you can use ninjutsu with scrolls we will provide. In other words, it will be very difficult to use ninjutsu without equipment. Does that mean you'll have to mainly rely on taijutsu? There is one effective method, though. Naruto. Hmm? This Earth Dragon Orb was created from the Earth Dendier's shining scale. Please try inserting this in the Dragon Blade. it will be, but it should be useful. Thanks! Naruto, I'm going to give you a map of Mount Koryu. It's old, but it should give you a basic grasp of where things are located. I'd like you to get going. Above all, be careful. You got it! Go! Don't get all nervous. <laughs> you say that, Deidara, but isn't there a big, scary monster in there? How should I know? Whatever we face, my art explosions will kill it. But I mean, you know how monsters are. With their super stretchy arms and how they can live with their heads cut off. That's just way too scary! Are you talking about Kakuzu and Hidan? Am I? <laughs> now that you mention it, I think I am! Well, if I think about it like that, the Akatsuki's like a group of monsters. <sighs> oh. <laughs> anyway, would Itachi and Kisume in charge of capturing the Genryu? Yeah, that's right. But even so, I don't like letting them have all the fun. We shouldn't be sticking our heads into other people's business, though. Isn't it that you're just bored and... Stop blabbering and hurry up. Get going. Oh, okay. Wait, you're not coming, Tidara? I'll look for a different entrance. There has to be someplace more... 
artistic. Hmm. Oh, come on. <laughs> you keep talking, but I bet you're as scared as me. Toby, I've decided what I'll be exploding first. Already? But there's nothing in particular over there. I'm talking about you, you dumb bastard! <laughs> these little C3 are cute! Wait, what's with these? Ha! Yeah! You can take that place! See that? Those tremors felt like an explosion. It seems Daedra and Toby have followed us. Couldn't you have turned down this job? It's too much for Daedra to handle more. You don't think Toby will help at all? Harsh. Something wrong? No. Let's go. Before we capture them, we need to confirm the Genryu's locations. You're rather cautious. Understood. Malcorio. That's the same information I got. My information came from the birds. It could never be false. I've been saying that that was the place from the very beginning! Yeah, but your sources are suspicious. What? Your sources are way more suspicious than mine. Sasuke asked Jugo too because he didn't trust yours. <laughs> See? He didn't trust yours either. Sugetsu, you little... Stop it, both of you. All three of you have the same result. Akatsuki is going to Mount Kodi. The animals told me where that is, too. All right. From now on, Heavy is going to Mount Kodi to find Itachi. <laughs>